Hey there, I'm Eliza with Ancestral Evolution, and today we're doing some kitchen magic. And we're turning some kefir, or kefir, into cream cheese. Da -da -da. So what I have here is some kefir that I strained the grains out of, and I just let it sit at room temperature for another 24 hours or so. As you see, we have some really nice separation. We've got whey at the bottom, and then our milk solids at the top. So this is perfect for our purposes. Over here, I just have a measuring cup and a sieve with a clean woven dish towel on top. You could use cheesecloth or something like that. And what we're gonna do is gently, I'm gonna disrupt just one side of the milk solids here and I'm just gonna pour it through the sieve. So this is gonna give you two products. You're gonna get a bunch of whey, which is awesome, and you're gonna get some cream cheese. So the whey, once it's all drained out of here, depending on how thick you like your cream cheese, you can decide how long you wanna let this drain. Keep your whey, it'll keep in the fridge for up to six months. You can use it to start a bunch of other fermentation projects. For instance, like sauerkraut or other lacto-fermented projects. Also great for soaking beans and things like that if you eat beans. Here you can see kind of the texture of this. If you wanted this to be more firm or thicker, you could let it sit even up to overnight in the fridge to let more of the moisture drain out of it. But I think this would be a really nice kind of spread as is. You could always add like herbs or spices to this if you wanted to kick it up a notch. But yeah, there you go. Kitchen magic, bam. If you like this video, be sure to like and subscribe. Also check out our all-natural tallow soap at ancestralevolution.net.